Hello there everyone and welcome once again to Ninja Guide in Black. I've brought a friend this time. This time my friend William joins me once again. We continue and this time we're going to do a very very special chapter because it's my least favorite chapter in the entire game. This one, chapter 11. Using the aqueduct, Ryu has arrived at the moat surrounding Zarkan, wherever a great wall blocks his path into the palace itself. Here comes the bullshit swimming level. Here comes the bullshit swimming level. See, now we know where we're going to be in the moat. Let me go ahead and equip the dragon sword and some arrows. Okay. Two of them, that's it. Two of them, that's it. Where is it? Explosive. Arrows would be just one. I'm pretty sure. That's it, right? Yeah. Alright. Okay, well. Here begins a lot of swimming. And the most repetitive little song <laughs> in the fucking game. It's so, so repetitive. But anyways. Um, let's, talk, let's, let's talk about the, the good parts of this whole chapter if there's any ah. the conversation is just flowing <laughs> <laughs> well um the graphics for this time <coughs> are still really good i mean come on <coughs> that's the whole game anyway oh yeah oh shit i'm not gonna go down there because oh i'm gonna start drowning i didn't go up to get oxygen shit i'm dumb because you're talking bullshit <laughs> there we go <laughs> okay there i did it I need to equip my windmill shuriken, I think, because I can, I can hit these guys. Not from the water. Oh, no. You can't throw them. So the I, gotta, I gotta do the, the sword? The sword. Just the good old... Mm -hmm. There we go. That's one. Ouchie. I wanna get caught in the... Ouchie. Don't eat me, Mr. Fish. Got you. Oh, uh, just narrowly avoided it. There you go. That okay. wasn't that narrow. And now I have to. Not oh. mandatory to kill him, but just for the sake of it, right? Well, yeah, it's not mandatory to kill these guys, right? No. Thank you for that reminder. <laughs> it was gonna be a pretty boring uh, thing to watch. You didn't grab the code, but we know what it is. The beginners are gonna be like, wait. What? <laughs> Oh yeah, we, we came all the way over here and we got the owl's eye, which allows us to see in the dark. Let me get some oxygen again before I drown like an idiot. Okay. And then we come here in the darkness. It's 0971, right? That's it. There we go. The memories come back floating. <laughs> there we go. There's still a time challenge going on. Still for those fish that you just It's crazy, fight. right? Whatever those enemies are called. I don't remember. And there we go. We have an item over here in this little guy, the spear gun. Let me see what he... <sighs> 33. Nothing. One more upgrade anyway. Some more upgrade we're good. Anything here? Nope, I think we're good. Oh, whoa, whoa. The swimming. Oh, now. Oh, there's a scar, I think. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, ooh, I, well, at least they put me in the, mm. in the in the right place. Can I just tap this and, and uh, he aims? Yeah, it's doable. No, he's not doing it. Doesn't always happen. There we go. Oh, there's no more? Okay, yeah, yeah. That's how you do that. <laughs> so, again, it must be pretty obvious by now that this chapter doesn't really have a lot of, like, fighting and action. It's just a lot of swimming. And that's not the most, like, the most fun thing to watch. So, you know what? Let me tell you a little bit about, about, about something that... I, th I don't think a lot of people know like ab about me. 
like well a lot of people that actually know me personally know this but not not not, not people that actually watch me here because i don't think i've ever spoken about this like uh, with anybody online but um i suffer from anxiety big surprise wow and um this game back back when, when back when this game came out um this was kind of like a the first game i ever played that was like Oh, like here's this extremely difficult thing that everybody's talking about and I started playing and the first time I played I remember that the game made me super anxious and I couldn't I, I just I just couldn't play it like I just I, I felt like helpless all the time and it, it wasn't a good experience for me the first time oh uh, why because it was uh, just too hard and I know I don't know like I felt frustrated I, I felt like dumb insufficient I don't know how to explain it like I felt like like yeah, I know what you mean. Like, like the, like the just... game, of, like the game affected me personally. I don't know yeah. how to explain it. Okay. And as as stupid as as, as that sounds, um, it made me like quit the game for the first time I, that, that I played it. At the time, at that time, I was uh, living with my friend Mike. He was my roommate, and um, I was like, yeah, like, like I, I'm not really into this. Like, like uh, I don't like feeling stupid, you know. And I stopped playing. And one day, <clears throat> I I decided to play it, but. Not taking it seriously, I decided to play like oh like I'm just gonna see like like, like I'm gonna see what the hell is up with this game like like what like like if, if to see if I can do anything, and then I actually started playing but like slower like I started like reading the instructions like what like I guess I actually like, oh, you like hadn't read uh, them before, no like I just started playing yeah you know but like, I mean I never read the manual but just the on screen instructions that it would give you I at least went exactly those exactly just for the I, sake I, I, of I started reading the little you know. knife I, I the little knife I guess. And uh, I started like, can you please look like, the surface real for the love of God? Okay. Okay, where am I going? Isn't there a scrap up here? No. No. It's way on the other side. Okay, so I'm gonna go in. Aha, okay. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Okay. This is where you need to go to do that. Yeah, and I'm the, the, the very, another, another, another very fun battle. Ay, Dios mío. So, anyways. Now this time that I that I started playing, I started playing this game like a little bit more more methodical, and I started playing it like like less like a little anxious kid, and more like a like 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 a person that was like thinking about what they were. Mm, so much fun! I'm in the water. I shouldn't be. Okay. Stop. Okay. 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 Now I gotta equip this one because I, I feel more. No, I have it already. No. No me nah. pegues, perro. Eres Send un perro. I know, but I'm 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 just bad. I'm bad at this game. Oh yeah, it's all over now. See? Would you please? Would you please? Oh my God! You see, the, the game waited to embarrass me until, until. There we go. There, there we go. go. Any more? Okay. No. Ugh. All right. Okay. <laughs> Where was I in my story? You had started playing more methodically. Yeah, I started playing more methodically, like 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 blocking more, like again less with anxiety and more. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, oh that's right. Wait, we have to oh, crank, I, I the need to crank the thing. Yeah, that's right. I've done this shit in a while. So yeah, you get the little crank down there, and you come up here. You crank this. This is so stupid. You open the. These are the little things the game does. It sends you uh, back just to do one extra little thing. Yeah. Back, jump back in, go in here. a few times throughout the game. Uh. So, anyways, and this time I started enjoying this game in like in a in a completely different way. Like I was like, oh, like you can charge this, you can grab this, like this weapon is good, like this. Oh, you can counter attack. Oh, you can. This. And I started approaching this game in a different way because. Back then, when I was younger, the only games in, in my life that I actually had to put like a lot of effort into were fighting games. Uh, all, yeah. the, all, you know, all the other Those games, you know, all the other games were not were not really a lot of work. But fighting games were like that, like work. It, it this was, one makes you play it like a fighting game. Exactly, and that and and, the, and that's what happened. I started approaching this game as a as a fighting game. You know, like putting in the work, practicing, like memorizing combos. This and they have this after this, and then shuriken, and then that, and then cancel this into that, and and it just started feeling like like completely different. And I started enjoying this game so so much. 
And then I was like, wait a minute, like, like maybe using this approach to, ga to gaming in general, just approaching games in general as fighting games, like, oh, what's the cheap stuff? Like, how can I break this? How can I make this game, like, how can I make every situation favor me? Like, like just playing not only to p finish the game, but to break the game Yeah. in some way, you know? Because when you play fighting games, at least in my experience, you play to find the absolutely most vile, <laughs> like, you know, like, like, like horrible cheapest things, stuff. cheapest stuff you can find. Because stuff that's safe for you and does a lot of damage to somebody else. Yeah. It keeps them blocking. Because you know, like that's what you want. Like, like you want, yeah. you want to win. Like, they, they're, either they're either blocking or getting hit. Yeah, and yeah. and when you're playing a fighting game, ultimately, like, it, I mean, you're playing to win unless you know you're letting the other person win. And in that case, Not it's but, uh, in which in which case it's it's you know yes insulting for the other person. Scarab, but anyways, Scarab is past, Scarab this, is past thing. this thing, right? Yeah. And we are. It's like there's like four scarabs in this in this river. In this game, you gotta find all the perfect little windows to hit the enemies, uh -huh. do the most damage in the smallest amount of time. Yep. So, to get the to get the time mm -hmm. to get the time. And then end up being the safest for you, where you're recovering the least from your moves, whether you miss or whether you land them or whatever. Basically, like in yeah. fighting games, you mm -hmm. want you want to be as safe as possible, do as much damage as possible, as quick as possible to end those rounds. And when I started again approaching gaming in general as fighting games, oh my god! Like I started enjoying games, like enjoying games, so much more. And I started enjoying uh, action games, especially in the games like this and games like Vanquish and games like Bayonetta and Devil May Cry. Like, like I started enjoying those games so much more because I started again just trying to find what's like the most cheap stuff you can do. Look at this! You put these two medallions here. And because you've done this down here, this thing explodes. How that works, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, but this game has mystical shit in it. Right. It counts. Exactly. And because it works within its own rules, <laughs> within the story's own established rules. Exactly. This game has already established so many, like, like. Like crazy things, like you put things in altar in, in altars and things happen. You put things in in statues and, mm -hmm. and doors open. Then why would you set it up that way anyway? Exactly. So check this out. Look at what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and ignore every single thing in this place. Just proceed with the actual game. And just gonna proceed with the actual game. <laughs> See, I heard the fun is down here, so I'm gonna oh, like yeah. swim down here and find the fun. Or swimming. Since I got the 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 scarab, all I have to get the one that is up is is down here in the chamber, right? Swimming up. Yeah, but that's on the other part, not in here. Well, you know where it is. Here, right? Further down. Oh, I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Yeah, this is the right way. Okay. <laughs> Oh man! If or you... is it? Dun, dun, dun. No, that's the right way. That's the right okay. way. Turn on, I don't remember if it's right or left. I think you have to go down and then yeah, you go up. It's yeah, down and then all the fuck way and up. Then all the way up when you go. My God, all this swimming. This guy, this guy has tremendous stamina. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they put it there, assuming the water shit was gonna happen. Wow! And are you saying? And you know what? Like, Ryu should be dead at, like, 10,000 times for all the changes in pressure in his bloodstream. But he's got the oxygen cylinder, man. <laughs> it also completely pressurizes him. He's <laughs> constantly adjusting. Well, or maybe he, because he's yeah. a ninja, he can just constantly change his, yeah. you know. Well, and also, he's in those enclosed spaces of water that maybe aren't as much pressure as, you know, that many atmospheres or whatever. Or not uh, atmosphere, what the hell am I mean? Well, uh, you what know is what it, I mean? uh, yeah, what is it that they call them? Uh, oh, crap. Well, whatever. Water thingies. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hold on. Uh, in Bioshock, I remember that when you're going down. Yeah, I know. Crap. All right, uh, we're idiots now. We don't know anything about nautical oh, terminology. No, no. no it's, it's fine. It's fine. Or, it's fine. Uh, I'm sure. Or I'm sure any viewer, or no, all five of you, ten of you, or all hopefully all thirty of you, look at that. Yeah. Uh, um, like that are like are watching and they're going ah, you know, like is this? Yeah. But what is it? Leagues. No, that's, that's an old school, <laughs> no, old school. Yeah, that, that's the old school one, right? Yeah. 
Man, what is it? That is fear. They close things that go down. Who do I fight him with? That Avilaro is the one that knocks him the frip out, right? Yeah. Definitely. Oh, level three. Oh, you weren't going to go back to get the other thing back in uh, up the elevator? Uh, there's a thing in the elevator. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There is in the oh, look at this. little safe. Behold. Oh, this is a very important moment. We're ruining it for the viewers. Check this out. Ryu has finally arrived. Sarkam. The path was real. Suddenly. Samurai Darth Vader appears. With this beautiful, beautiful Rachel. Them, them's fighting words, Doku. Don't call me failure. I didn't fail. I only temporarily allow you to live, you basutaru doll. Get it so there could be a game. Come on, bre. No. No, no. Oh, what an asshole. Yeah. Roll through that and you can hit him. Put towards Y. That's another one that's good now. Yeah. After five. After five, but not if you end up blocking any of them. Why was he being a dick? Oh, no me pegues. Ouchie. Hold on. You have to completely be missed by the five hits. And then it'll let you hit him at the end. Oh my god, twice in a row he does that and he heals. I'm being bad. Yes. <laughs> I don't know why I'm being so bad. Oh. Yes, Ryu. That's precisely the direction. Stop. I just wanted to see that. Bye, Dougal. Bye, Dougal. Nice Not dodge. Enough. There you go. So dumb. It's like, whoop. Oh, why? There we go. See? If only he had done that the first time they fought. He didn't have the Devil Arrow level 3. My true master? The Emperor? What do you mean? We're not so different, you and I. The big not Vader guy telling you your true master is the Emperor. Yes. They invented that themselves. That's never been in any other story I've heard of. Nuh uh. My hatred will not be so easy. My hatred. <laughs> you see, like. Is he saying the hate flows through him? Yep. Look at that. And, and I think he's going to become a blue ghost. Mm -hmm. That's exactly, uh. You see? That's exactly what an original storyteller would write. Yep. I love her outfit. She needs to talk to Batman about that. Okay. <clears throat> All right. And well, that concludes the best chapter. The best chapter in the game. Ah, look at that. Like it no, seems like it, it seems I did it well despite all the stuff that I skipped. Now, although it appears as though Ryu defeated Doku, his vengeance is still incomplete. The Dark Dragon is in the hands of the Holy Vigor Emperor. What will become of Rachel and her sister? Pero que pasa? Let's find a safe point. I 
And with this save point, we have reached the end of the episode. Thank you so much for joining me again in Ninja Gaiden Black. And we're going to continue next time in the caverns. See you next time. Thank you for joining me, Will. No problem. Later. Well, I'm thinking